Hey guys, what's up? Hey, um, so over here I'm going to show you I just uncovered a bee nest right under the wall that um, I built a few weekends ago. It's been a while since I posted, but um, I got some seeds starting and I had to restart them again because it didn't work the first time. So, da da da. Now I got a bee nest. Let's go look at that. Okay, so when I say bee nest, I excuse, excuse me please, um, I mean yellow jacket nest. And let's not get too close. Let's just use the zoom here. Nugget, get the heck away. So I don't know if you see any bees coming up, but I got a, a trap right there at the pheromone and some salami in the bottom. And they made a nest right under the friggin' bricks. Or the alabox. See them flying in and out of there? Those suckers, those stinking yellow jackets. And they're so dangerous for kids. And, you know, my wife could be watering and step on the bricks the wrong way and just, you know, or just make them mad and man they bite and they sting and they'll sting in the same spot just to, for insult to injury um so i want to get rid of these things i hope they fly into that trap the wind's blowing towards them so i hope they smell that it hasn't been working yet i don't know why um, i know another way to kill them you dump uh uh this stuff called seven right on their nest and it just makes them super mad and they but they ended up taking the poison the, in, the uh, insecticide into their nest but it's you know it's using chemicals and I want to use all organic methods of gardening here, so I don't know. We'll see if this trap works, but if it doesn't, I might have to use drastic measures. All right, guys, so that little setup I had just now, it isn't working. I don't know why. They are not a trap. I've never seen it not work, but those traps usually work like a boss. Right now, maybe it's because they're building a nest. They're not attracted to the pheromone and the salami I put in there on the, on the little spikes on the trap. So... I looked up a YouTube video and watched this guy make his own homemade trap, and he caught far more in this homemade trap than um, than his uh, store-bought ones. And I'll show you how that's so what we got here is a Pyrex, kind of a big one, the biggest one I think we had in our cabinet. I got a board, an old leftover board from some furniture I put together, some old screws from a project, a screw gun, and tonight is well, today is Mother's Day, and we're gonna I was gonna barbecue some uh, chicken. But I don't think my wife will mind if I use a little bit for this bee, for this, uh, bee bait. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to screw on the chicken to this board. And you'll see what happens after that. All right, guys. So I got my raw chicken meat screwed down. I didn't go too far. You know, I didn't go all the way through. Just a little bit, just to pin the meat down. And I'm going to fill this up with some uh, dish soap here. And not too much, just... Uh, You'll see why because it this guy says it acts as a surfactant when you put water in here and it makes their wings kind of like probably kind of stick together or just like they what they're going to do <clears throat> is i'm going to put this on top like this see that they're going to fly in here and i guess when they fly in then they they actually like to go down as they come out and then that's when they stick in the dish soap so we'll see if this works all right, so it's been like a minute. Um, I just put away the tools and stuff, and I don't know. I don't see any bees in there, uh, or bees, gosh, yellow jackets. Uh, now they're thinking about it. I see one buzzing around. He's thinking about it. He, he definitely, they like the smell of that chicken, and it's like, has a, we just have an island teriyaki sauce marinating the chicken, so it's like sweet meat, which is like exactly what people say that uh, yellow jackets like as bait. Um, uh, they're just so focused on, see, they're building their nest right in that little cavity where I left the gopher wire. And they are just being stubborn and building a nest right now. So I hope this works because I want to give the, I'm going to have to give this guy some credit for sure. The YouTuber that showed me how to do this. So hopefully it works. All right. So this isn't working fast enough for me. I want to like go ahead and poke this nest. You know how they say not to poke the hornet's nest? Well, I'm gonna go do it. You tell me, huh? I see one, he's buzzing around. He's thinking about it, but he's like, oh, I wanna build a nest, no. Yeah, come on, get it. So I'm thinking I'm gonna poke it with this bamboo stick I have <laughs> and then run. Okay, wish me luck. Yeah, I'm gonna be very quiet. I'm gonna creep over here and show you what I did. So I unearthed the, uh, the brick. Now look, get a close up of this. They're pissed off right now. So I might get stung right here, but See these? See that nest right there? See it? Do you see where I'm like pointing? See where my pointer finger is right there? That's a paper nest right there. And I roused them, and I want them to get into that bait right there. So I'm gonna have to spray that nest with chemical, unfortunately, if not, take the bait. All right, all right, 
you guys. So unfortunately, it's resorted to this because the trap over there has not caught anything. So we're gonna use a chemical, unfortunately. Let's go use it. All right, so you see that paper nest down there? It's a, actually a really small nest, so let's spray it. Put this back up. All right, that's a lot. Hopefully that works. All right, guys. So here's what's left of the nest. I don't know if you can see that. Like, <laughs> kind of hard to see, but let me open up the bag here. You can kind of see that in there. They got their little eggs, the little uh, larvae, some dead bees, and their yellow jackets, sorry, but big old larvae in there. Those things were, <laughs> they were really focused on building that nest. It was a super small nest, but the chemical worked. That's uh, what saved the day. All right. Not in my backyard. Ha ha, vain attempt at humor. <laughs>